Farm Food Safety Worker Guide. What do you need to know to keep yourself, your family, and your community safe? First, thank you for the work you do. It is essential to keep food on the tables of many people. At the farm, we harvest produce that people consume fresh, without cooking to kill pathogens. Because of this, we need to take steps to reduce the risks of contaminating the produce we sell. This is especially important to protect people who face greater risks of getting sick with foodborne illness, like adults over 65, children under 5, and those who are pregnant. According to the Center for Disease Control, more than 48 million people get sick from foodborne illnesses each year, 128,000 are hospitalized, and 3,000 die. Following appropriate guidelines can go a long way toward reducing foodborne illness. Please keep in mind that we always want you to talk with a crew leader or manager if you notice any hazards or other things that need to be addressed, or if you have ideas for how to improve food safety on the farm. Here are guidelines you should follow to help you prevent contamination at the farm. You will get training specific to your job responsibilities. Please practice good hygiene, including regular bathing or showering. Keep your fingernails short. Long nails make hand washing less effective and can puncture the skin of produce, allowing pathogens to grow. Jewelry that cannot be adequately cleaned and sanitized before handling produce must be removed or covered with a clean glove to prevent contamination of produce. Do not allow work clothes to become excessively dirty, or they may contaminate produce. Change clothing before touching produce if contaminated with bodily fluids or animal waste. Any gloves, aprons, boots, or other protective gear worn when handling produce should be removed before using the bathroom, cleaned regularly, and stored in a clean location. If you wear gloves, replace them whenever they are torn or soiled. If gloves are reusable, clean them as often as necessary to ensure they do not become a source of contamination. Be sure you know where bathrooms are located. You may use the bathroom at any time during the workday. Tell a crew leader or manager if you need transportation. Urinating, peeing, and defecating, pooping, should be done in the toilet, never in the field. Toilet paper should be put in the toilet, not in the trash can. Each bathroom has soap, potable water, and paper towels for you to use when washing your hands and is cleaned regularly. Let a crew leader or manager know right away if a bathroom needs to be restocked or cleaned. Regular hand washing is one of the most effective ways to stay healthy and keep produce safe. Always wash your hands, after using the toilet, before starting work, before returning to work after lunch or breaks, before putting on gloves, before and after eating, after touching animals or animal waste, and any other time your hands may be contaminated. Hand sanitizer, while helpful, should never be used as a replacement for hand washing. To wash your hands thoroughly, always follow these steps. 1. Wet your hands and wrists with clean, running water. Two. Apply soap, lather, and rub your hands together for at least 20 seconds, scrubbing the fronts and backs of your hands between your fingers and under your nails. 3. Rinse your hands well under clean, running water. 4. Dry your hands with a clean paper towel, then turn off the faucet using this towel. 5. Throw the paper towel in a trash can. If you don't feel well in any way, either before coming to work or during the workday, Please notify your supervisor immediately so they can ensure you get the needed treatment or rest and can reassign work tasks as needed. If you have symptoms like fever, diarrhea, vomiting, nausea, or jaundice and may have a contagious illness, you should go home. If you prefer to keep working and feel up to it, you may ask if it is possible to do different work tasks that will not risk getting others sick. Report any injuries to your supervisor to ensure you get the needed treatment. You will always have access to basic first aid supplies while working at the farm. First aid kits are in each farm vehicle. Be sure you know where these are located and let a crew leader or manager know right away if you notice a kit is missing or supplies are low. Minor cuts or other wounds present a food safety risk because blood and other bodily fluids can contaminate produce. Any minor wounds should always be bandaged. And if the wound is on the hands, a clean glove should be worn over the bandage. Harvest tools and containers should be cleaned regularly and kept free from contamination. Check all tools and containers before using them to ensure they meet our cleanliness standards and report any issues, if you can't fix them yourself, to a crew leader or manager. 
do not harvest produce that is contaminated with animal feces that shows damage from wildlife or other sources or that is otherwise likely to be contaminated. Dispose of any produce that has dropped on the ground, unless it grew underground or on the ground. Dropped produce can be damaged and presents risk of contamination. Avoid letting produce sit in the wash water any longer than needed, and be careful not to overfill wash tanks with produce. The longer produce sits in water, especially with other produce on top of it, the greater the risk that contaminated water might infiltrate the produce. Drinking water and cups will always be readily available to you while working at the farm. Let a crew leader or manager know right away if these run low. If you bring your own water container, it must not be made of glass, which would be hazardous if broken. Notify a crew leader or manager if you see evidence of a pest problem such as droppings, damaged product, or rodent traps that are continually having to be emptied. Avoid contact with animals wherever possible. Change clothing and footwear when moving from areas where animals are kept to areas where produce is handled. If you are in contact with animals, wash your hands before touching produce and or take other appropriate steps to reduce risks of contaminating produce. If you are handling soil amendments that contain any raw manure or compost, wash your hands and make sure your clothes, boots, and gloves are clean before touching produce. If you are working with chemicals, Always be sure to follow proper farm standard operating procedures and label instructions, and to wear appropriate protective equipment. Please always use your judgment to handle produce in a manner that protects it from contamination, and let a crew leader or manager know if you have ideas for how to improve farm food safety.